Here's a quick overview of the latest update to Google Chrome. The feature users have been asking for most often is a way to remove items from the most visited section of our new tab page. With our latest update, this is now possible. It's useful if you end up with a site in there that you'd rather not admit to visiting quite as often as you actually do. To remove it, click Remove Thumbnails. Then click the X on the page that you don't want to see anymore and hit Done. Another really useful feature is full screen mode. This is one of those features that you might only use occasionally, but when you do, it's really nice. I use it when I'm giving a presentation and I want my slides to take up the entire screen. To invoke full screen mode, go to the Tools menu and select Full Screen. You can also just hit F11 to toggle the feature on and off. The feature that I get asked about most often when I call home is Form Autofill. Of course, my parents don't call it that. They ask me when Chrome will start remembering their email address so they don't have to retype it into the same forms all the time. Now I can finally tell them that it's ready. If you go to a page where you've entered something into a form before, all you have to do is start typing it again and you can select from a list of things you've typed before. We've also made a number of improvements that aren't as visible, but will still make web browsing more enjoyable. For instance, we've done a lot of work to make Google Chrome even more stable. Since our initial launch, we've fixed over 300 bugs that cause crashes. Most importantly, we continue to make speed our number one priority. Thanks to a new version of V8, our JavaScript engine, heavily interactive sites run even faster. And with a new version of WebKit, page load time has improved significantly. If you've already installed Google Chrome, you don't have to do anything to get these improvements. They'll be automatically updated to the latest version very soon. If you haven't had a chance to try it yet, you can get up and running in less than five minutes by installing it from google.com slash chrome.